Hello everyone. Let's work on this very quickly. We have x squared minus y squared equals 8. Now the first thing to be done is to apply difference of two squares. So we have x plus y into bracket um, x minus y equals 8. But 8 here can be written as 4 times 2. Okay, so we have x plus y into bracket x minus y is equal to 4 times 2. And now we are going to compare so that we can see x plus y is equal to 4 becomes our equation 1. And then x minus y equals 2 becomes our equation 2. Now we can apply elimination method of, um, sub of simultaneous equation. We are going to subtract. See that x minus x is gone. y minus minus 2, that, that will be the same thing as y plus y. And it's 2y, which is equal to 4 minus 2, which is 2. Meaning that y is equal to 2 over 2, and our y is equal to one and then when y is equal to one let's pick equation one x plus y is equal to four so if y is equal to one then x plus y is equal to four and then x is equal to four minus one which will give us three so therefore we have x to be equal to three and y to be equal to um okay yes one x to be equal to three and y to be equal to one now we can still have other solutions to this problem because it can also be written as eight times one so when you have x squared minus y squared equals eight then you can write this we can now write this as x plus y into bracket um, x minus y, which will be equal to 8 times 1. Okay, so that um, x plus y is equal to 8 becomes equation 1, and x minus y equals 1 becomes equation 2. Now, let's put this, okay, let's eliminate using um, elimination method. So that x minus x is gone, then y minus y. Okay, we have y minus minus y. That will give us 2y, which will be equal to 8 minus 1, and it's 7. So from here, y is equal to 7 divided by 2. And 7 divided by 2 is the same thing as 3.5. Okay, and then if you take a step further, you have to put this into one of the equations. Let's say equation 1, x plus y equals 8. And then x plus 3.5, because y is 3.5, is equal to 8. And then x is equal to 8 minus 3.5. x is equal to... 4.5 now let me write okay so these are the solutions now we have that x is equal to 4.5 and um, y is equal to 3.5 then we also had that x is equal to 3 and y is equal to 1. So these two satisfy the equation given to us and you can check it out yourself. Thank you for watching.